this short video we're going to look at how to customize your cash flow invoices from your overview screen select settings and if you scroll down to configuration settings we'll select PDF themes you've probably already got up set up the classic theme if you select that it will then take you to all the options for adjusting uh, various things on the invoice. So on the basic screen you can look about uh, where you have your address positioned, where you have your titles positioned, what size fonts you want to use etc. On the images screen you can upload your logo and have it either left aligned or centered or right aligned and you can have stamps on there if people have paid in advance or if an invoice becomes overdue. Um, borders and margins are really just used for printing so you can have different uh, borders and margins depending on your printing sizes and then on the miscellaneous um, options screen you can show here um, payments that have been made against the invoice you can um, show VAT split out for each item on the invoice rather than as a total Right at the bottom of the invoice you can include things like your company number, um, we'd normally write in there registered in England and Wales and then the company number. And then in the additional text field this is where you might put in your bank details, so you might put in your bank sort code and account number. Um, the information you put in this box will generally appear just below the um, amount fields on the invoice. So you can add various fields to your invoices, you can add them to your quotes, your purchase orders, um, so you write an authorised by for example, or your packing slips. Once you've made the changes that you want, if you then select save and preview, that will show you the impact of what your changes are. So we can see here we've got a box here which says bank details on it and we can see our company number right down at the bottom of the screen. And if we're happy with that then we'll just save and exit. 